Hi guys, we're Ghana Bound, I'm Yaba and welcome back to our channel. Today I'm so excited to show you this beautiful development, readily built and available and expanding. So I'll be showing you phase one, but guys they've got all the way to phase five. We're going to be showing you a two and a three bedroom today, so let's go have a look. The office is directly on site, so any issues you have on site, they're readily available to help. So this is the range of two bedrooms. They have fully sold out apart from one. So I'm going to give you a quick tour inside to have a look. Okay, so this two bedroom has the main entrance with greenery. Yes, we love to see it. And this car parking space. You should be able to fit a large car in this space, like a four by four. So it enters straight into the main hall, as you can see. So we'll come through nice spacious living area, you can hear my echo, and a dining area. So the air conditioning does not come with the house, but you will have the attachments to put your own one in. The dining space then leads on to the kitchen. So enough space for a couple, a young family, or an individual, and then it leads on to the back space. So you can actually have a low maintenance space here. So we've got plenty of space in the back if you want to have some shrubbery, some chairs and table, and even a parasol to enjoy that morning coffee. Leading on from the living space is a guest washroom as well. Always useful if you don't want anyone to go upstairs. <laughs> you've got your main electric switchboard, which is here. And you've got storage space underneath the stairs. You can even put some shelving in there, store books, shoes, whatever you want to use it for. We're now going to have a look at the two bedroom and the bathroom that are upstairs. Once you reach the top, you'll see a nice big window. So if you come to the top, you'll see a nice big window behind you, which brings in lots of light. That's what we like as light. Traditionally in Ghana, we build the rooms with small windows and it's quite dark, but... So you've got the first bedroom, lovely space. A big space on the side here, which you can put a wardrobe, even your TV can go there. And you've got lots of plugs, so you've got options. You've got your TV point here, actually. So it'd be useful to put your TV here. And then you can have the bed here. And you can control the lights from your bed, always handy. This two bedroom is the last one available and it is now on the market for $85,000. So like I told you, we're going to give you a whole load of options for under $100,000. What we're going to do now is show you the three bedroom. It's fully furnished so you can get an idea of what exactly it will look like and what the finishes will look like when you're ready to move in. Let's get.
So now we're going to show you the three bedroom detached property, which is called the Sida. And I've got the beautiful Mashofa here. So thank you for joining me. She's going to take me around and explain anything. So if you have got any more questions that I may not be covering myself, Mashofa will. And you can ask any others in the description box below as well. All right, so we're going to have a look at this one. Okay, so Mashofa, on this strip, what um, phase is this now? How many of the three bedrooms and four bedrooms are available? Okay, so we have um, two four bedrooms available on this lane. Yep. And then we have three three bedroom houses available on this lane. Fantastic. However, we still have more houses available on the subsequent Because you have phase five now, right? That phase four. Phase four coming up. Whoa, so there's still there's still opportunity to buy. Okay, so yeah. We still have so much land at the back there for ah. phase five. So the moment we are done with phase four. Now we are selling these five already. Okay, yes. already. And for that, we have um, a payment plan for it, which can take you to about three years to do payment. That's good. People often ask about more than a year. So, with um, the off plan ones, you can buy off plan and sort of have an input with the type of layout, maybe. Is exactly. that an option? So, you can have an input in your house, okay, but that has to do with interior changes. Okay. But with the external, we still always want to maintain the facade. Yeah. So we don't really do much of external, but internal, you can always have internal changes. Makes so sense. Yeah. Makes sense. We're going to have a look at this three bed. I'm really excited. All okay. right, let's go. Okay, so let's go in from there. Okay. So already I'm noticing this greenery. It's nice to see the green space. And it's spacious. It's like you guys have really allowed for elbow room. I love this. Yeah. So eventually this goes, it covers up and it's going to be so ah, beautiful. It'll have, you won't be able to see through. You won't be able to see through. Yeah. And then this is your green area. And you have your car park over here, which can take about two cars. because so many people have asked us about renting. Okay. They want to rent out these spaces. Is that something that's okay? Yes, it's okay. Yeah. You can always buy your house and put it up for rent. Yeah. I mean, we don't have everybody living in here, but most of them put up their house for, the, for rent, and it gives you extra cash. Exactly. No argument there. <laughs> and it also means that while someone may be out the country, they will be able to maintain. You guys will maintain you the maintain house. It. That's why you pay for the service, service charge. And how much is the service charge? So it takes care of um, gardening, it takes care of security, yeah. uh, cleaning as well. Yeah. I love this side. This section is so nice. It's also a nice break for if you if it's raining, you don't drag it into the house. house. And you can always have a chair here and sit down. You know, just have a good time outside your house. I can't wait to go in. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Come in here in the living room. Whoa, so spacious. Over there, there's the shelves where you can keep the boots or whatever you want to put in there. There's so much light in there to allow for. So much. <laughs> so much light. Yeah. And this is a show home, isn't it? This is a show home. So it comes unfurnished, guys. Right. You cannot have the furniture. <laughs> But one thing that strikes me first and foremost is this space. Okay. And then even with furniture in here, I'm echoing. And you've got huge double doors, big windows, and even on the other side where the dining room is as well. I'm so big on lights. Anything to do with lights. Thank you. 
you know, you have the real estate students who are working on that line, fresh paint. Big window. And then to the side, we have, I guess, uh, the storeroom. And you can have your uh, washing machine in here because we made provisions for the washing machine out there. And all the electrical points to your house also are found in here as well. Is this the door that, that's not the door that leads to the main water? No, no, this is a door that leads outside of your kitchen. So this one leads directly to your car. car. Okay. So let's go out and then look at that. Be sure that a comfortable staircase is easy to find. It is actually, the fence is short, which is good. Mm -hmm. And again, plenty of windows, plenty of light. And then this is in Ghana here, traditionally we build with small windows and the rooms are quite dark. Yeah. So it's nice to see this. And a, a key note as well, you'll see those big plants and you know pictures and things here. It shows as well that it doesn't eat into the space. So you'll notice it's actually a spacious place. With this rail, I know some people will ask me about the handrail. Does it come with a glass one or will it come with another railing? So with the rails, they actually down to individual specifications. I mean, we have components that come in there. Some prefer to have the rail itself, some prefer to have the glass. Yeah. So depending on what you want. You know, I was telling you that people are allowed to make changes to their homes, especially when it comes to the interior. For the external, we can't really do much for the interior. So we need to make it as comfortable as possible for yourself yeah. because you're buying it. So we, I mean, there are a couple of houses that it's not glass, but it is a handrail. The rails. Yeah. I think while I've got children, it'll be handrails, and when I kick them out, it'll be glass. <laughs> you know that's what a lot of people usually do. As parents, those are their kids. They're going for the handrail. It's 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 much more safer. Yes. Yeah. Okay. So if I can use the bedroom, and I can set all the rooms and things, and. So we have the AC points over there, there's the bed space, and then you're very important. And the windows. So we make room for you to have you know huge windows yeah. to allow for natural light and then fresh air into your home. So nice. Yeah. So nice. And again, the light at the top, the top adds to it. Yeah. And the view is so green. That's what we want. It's the green. It's the green. So it has to be green. It has to be green. Yeah. The washroom, yeah. Each room comes with its own washroom. Um, we have the water heater. There's the bath and the shower, and you know your toiletries as well. So now we come into the second bedroom. Yes. Also, several spacious. Um, actually, you can have two beds in here. Especially for the two stubborn kids or amazing kids of the house. We keep them stubborn here. and troublesome. <laughs> so this is where troublesome and this is where stubborn. stubborn. <laughs> and they can always have a good time, you know, in their room. Yeah. And I can keep saying the windows. So they can Big. enjoy the natural light and yeah. have fresh air coming into the room. Yeah. And the wardrobes of course. Where you can keep your kids. And uh, there's the washroom. Good. Good size shower. There's the shower. So the two people shower, Sam says. Two people shower. Brilliant. This comes with the water, water heater. Water heater, yes. Yeah. And Even then there's the vent as well. Yeah. Good.
Thank you so much for showing me around. This house is beautiful. I can see why they are selling out so fast. I know you mentioned it earlier, but how many are available to buy? Okay, so we have a lot. I should yes. say, I would say we have a lot. Um, if you are looking to move in immediately, there's a home for you. If you are looking to, you know, make payments towards your home also, there's, you know, a home for you. So we have ready to move in and then we have homes we are still building. Like those are off plan, we are still building and you can have inputs in them as well. At any point in time, there's a house for you. Yeah. So if someone wants to buy um, property being built right now, how long does it take for it to be built, to be finished? It takes six to nine months. So that's when we start off plan and then we start to build. So yeah. it takes six to nine months to build. Mm -hmm. And you build in phases or would you build one house ready for someone to go into? No, we build in phases. Actually, we build in lanes. Ah. So a certain, a particular kind of lane has to be ready and completed before we move into the next lane. Because, you know, the construction has to be done in uh, an appropriate way whereby you don't have, you know, I mean, this house is completed, the next house is still under construction, no. Uh, we take our time, we build in lanes, and then at every point in time, once a lane is completed, we move to the next lane. So, like I was saying, we have the first phase, we have the second phase, and now this is the third phase we are building. Immediately after this third phase, we go to our fourth phase. So that's why I keep saying this. At every point in time, there's a house for you. Brilliant. And also to suit your budget and how yes. you want to have your payment being done. Yes, we will talk about money because I'm here <laughs> for that. I'm representing a lot of people and they have a lot of questions about payment plans, mm -hmm. also um, the cost of housing, how negotiable those prices are, mm -hmm. all of those. We'll talk about those next. Mm -hmm. So how do the prices range and what's available to buy at those prices? Okay, so our prices, we actually have homes ranging from two beds to five bedrooms. Um, and our prices also range from $85,000 to about $300,000. So depending on the kind of house you are buying and the payment plan you are going in for, mm -hmm. then you have your house. Um, there's a two bed going for $85,000. Three beds um, are in the price range of $140,000 to $185,000. And then we have the four beds and the five beds that are much higher because, you know, it makes room for more space and then more rooms and all Whoa, of that. You do five beds? Yeah, we do five beds. I didn't beds. even tell you guys they did five beds. <laughs> <laughs> I would have shown you the five beds. Okay. Let's talk about payment plans. What other options and do you accept mortgages? How can someone purchase this house? So, I mean, before you purchase, there's a form you fill out to show that you're interested in it really ready to put down payment um, so we have two different financing options the self-financing and then the mortgage so with the self-financing you choose to do a down payment you, you need to do a down payment of about 20% mm -hmm. of the total price of the house and then we spread the remaining balance for a period of time so if you are going in for one year we spread the remaining balance for one year if you are going in for two years, we spread the remaining balance for two years. If you are going in for three years, we spread the remaining balance for three years. However, if you choose to acquire your house through a mortgage, you still need to put down the down payment because that's your equity. Okay, it shows yeah. the bank that you are committing to buy this property at this particular place. Okay, And uh, the bank now comes in to finance the remaining balance and you can finance usually up to 80%. Even we have banks that are willing to finance up to 100%. percent oh, they wow. are willing to, but you just need to show your credit scores. Yeah. I mean, show them that you are working, you have monthly salary coming in, and all of that yeah. before they, you know, facilitate your mortgage. Which banks? Which banks offer these mortgages that you work with particularly? Okay, so we work with Stanley Bank. We work with First National Bank as well, and then Republic Bank. And all of these banks are available to you know help you go through your mortgage process and and we even assist to make it more easier yeah so you don't need to go there and then go get yourself stressed out oh. you just you know give us your documents and then we facilitate the process for wow you. that's really making much more easier yeah because and you're easy crap <laughs> this whole process of buying yeah. everything fantastic yeah. so once someone has 
paid the one year they get their keys. Yeah. I always get asked this, if they have not finished paying, can they move in? No. So the thing about our homes is that you need to be done with payment before you can move into your house. Yeah. So once you're done with payment, we hand over your keys to you. Okay. Yeah. And that's so that's why we allow people to have, you know, the various options. Maybe um, you know you'll be done with payment in the next three years. I mean, you know yourself, you know the work you do and the kind of financial strength you have. So instead of rushing in and coming in for a one-year payment plan, how about you relax and going for a two-year payment plan, whereby, I mean, you wouldn't stress yourself, but you just take your time and then do your monthly payment. Amazing. And how about for those who have gone in for, let's say, a two-year payment plan, but they've managed to collect the funds, can they do an early payment or is there a, a penalty? For no, early? there's no penalty. There's no penalty. You can always come in and then just do an early payment. Oh my goodness, you made it really straightforward, really yeah, simple. Yeah. Okay. So could you please tell me about the a bit more about the development? Okay. Um, this is a construction that started in 2017 and we're looking at building I mean it's a whole big community we're developing. Aside from your homes, there's also a recreational activity or um, should I say a lifestyle activity you can engage in, in the estate. So we've made provisions for a swimming pool, there's a tennis court, there's a, a gym, there's a, a bar, Whoa. A, and an open view sitting area. So you get to sit there, interact with other homeowners, socialize with kids and all of that. There's also a children's playground for the kids in the community. So the kids can also play and have their own good time. Over there. Yeah. And I noticed as well, you have one bedroom apartments. I know they pretty much sold out. Yeah. There's only one left. There's just two of them. Yeah. And it's just one that is left. And it's next to, directly next to the recreational area. Yeah. 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 Anyone who wants to do Airbnb, it's a good ride for you. It, snap it up. And how much is the apartment going for? It's going for 100,000. There you go. Yeah. Tema Community 25 is already very developed. So in terms of hospitals and schools, do we have access to those? Yes, we do. I mean, just at the Ten before you get to this place, we have the Mount Carmel Hospital, yeah, Mount, Mount Carmel Facility Hospital and Fertility Hospital. Uh, there's the Raha International School as well. Kids can you know go there. We also have Candlelight, which is a daycare for oh, babies, good. and then there's also DPS on our stretch. Okay. So for schools and then hospitals, we are coming. Take, yeah. And then there's also the Twenty Five Palace Mall where you can yeah. shop for groceries. And yeah. You know the pharmacy as well yeah. and then there's the so community 25 mall so there's the palace mall but then there's the actual mall, mall as also. well guys if you have any other questions anything at all you can reach out to us through our website www and for those who are serious about making an inquiry to purchase your own you can access us there as well if you haven't already please subscribe in three two one way welcome to the family and see you in the next one bye